So this is the Celestian Creamback Neo. Now this, I am really excited about, for several reasons. Um, Celestian sent me this because this is a brand new design, and it sounds a lot like the Creamback M and H, which were designed based on the old Greenbacks, which is the classic rock speaker. Thing is, the Creamback speakers, the M and the H, were designed to handle a lot more power than original, but they weigh loads. Like the Creamback H weighs nearly five kilos, um, so nine or ten pounds per speaker. So if you think if you've got a four by twelve with four of them, that's nearly forty pounds or nearly twenty kilos of just speaker, and that's not even counting the wood. So if you've ever wondered why your four by twelve cabinets are so heavy, it's because of those. Whereas um, this new design, the Celestian Creamback Neo. The magnet is made out of neodymium, which is also known as rare earth magnet. Now the deal with this is you can see how small this magnet is because it's so strong as a magnet, you don't need nearly as much of it. Which is great for speaker design because that means that compared to the uh, Creamback H, which I could barely hold on my leg because it was almost cutting, this I can hold with my little finger and that is a massive improvement and the tone isn't that different I mean yes it's slightly different because of a different construction but compare them and this is less than two kilos so less than four pounds so if you can imagine cutting 12 kilos on 24 25 pounds out of your 4x12 cab suddenly loading in and out of venues becomes a lot easier, I mean, if you've got back trouble or even if you've got to get up a flight of stairs with a 4x12 cab and you've ever thought, oh, if there was any way of making this easier. Imagine having the cab where you take more than half the weight of the speakers out and yet you can have this fantastic, massive tone. Each one of these speakers can handle 60 watts as well, which means two of these and a 2x12 you can probably pick up with one hand and hold it over your head and it will handle a 100 watt guitar head with no problem at all, no matter how loud you turn that up. Now if that's not priceless to a lot of guitarists, I don't know what is because we search for tone so much, but weight is a massive problem. I mean, there's only so much gear you can fit in the van in terms of weight without breaking the axle. <laughs> there's only so much gear you can load in and out of venues. I mean, this and a 1x12, even a well-made, like, 18mm thick plywood 1x12, you can still carry with one hand. Because that weight saving is incredible. I mean, I'm a studio musician, I don't really need to cart them anywhere, but even moving the cabs from here to over there and back is... I mean, it's fine until you end up pulling your back. These are absolutely fantastic. So I hope you found this useful, uh, thanks to Celestian for sending me the Creamback Neo, and even though I had to send it back soon, I don't really want to because these are uh, absolutely fantastic. Um, stick around and uh, have a listen to the other speaker comparisons that we're doing, we're doing a Vintage 30, we're doing a Creamback M&H, so you can compare these directly, same track, same everything. Um, we're comparing the Eddie Van Halen EVH, uh, the Lynchback and the K100. Then we're going to go ahead and compare a load of microphones on the same speaker. So uh, there's a lot to be going at and I hope you find this useful. Thanks for watching, I'm Adam Steele for the Hot Pole Studios. See you in the next video. One more thing, 
uh, Zilla are going to be giving away one of these 1x12 fat baby cabs. So um, listen to all the speaker comparisons that we've done and have a listen, decide what your favourite one is and then go to the Zilla Facebook page, I'll put a link in the description below and tell them what your favourite speaker was out of these and you'll be in with the chance of winning that cab with that speaker in it.